Welcome hoarders, they're going to be playing some more Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, where are we at right now? Are we back at that infected lake? I actually want to try because I think that we are. Um, in case you didn't watch uh, the last episode, um, this could work. we... What's the first thing I have? We had to relocate. Um, we had to... Yee! Um, after we relocated, uh, well, in order to relocate, we had to, um, go to some random cave where these crazy people were already living, kill them, and then we took over that camp. Um, then... What we did, got him. Um, then what we did was I went to go. No, 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 no. Is that one of the sick ones? That uh, is just a regular bluegill. Um, then what we did was we went and got on a um, okay. hot air balloon ride. We learned how to drive it or fly it. Um, and then what we wanted to do was fly over the prison to see, I can't remember his name for the life of me, um, our one friend that got put in prison, um, why can't I remember his goddamn name? Was it John? I think it's John. I think John was his name. Uh, to fly over the prison to see if he was... Uh, out in the fields where we could get him. Um, then I went to uh, the bar where I fell off my horse and found out that I have tuberculosis, which as far as I know is incurable as of the time of you know, the time that the game is set. Um, unfortunately, which reminded me of the movie oh, oh, Tombstone. Um, I gotta let that fish have it for a little bit. Um, the movie Tombstone, that actually happens to the main character on there. Oh, a salmon. A whole salmon, boy. Those are the ones that are worth money. Uh, I'm gonna keep that, and then we are... That's some, you know, good stuff to do when you have free time. Uh, put that away. And I guess the tuberculosis, um, prevents me from getting my health all the way up I guess it keeps it down or drains it or something um so I really can't do a whole lot about that um so as far as right now I'm under the impression that Arthur is dying and there's no way to prevent him from dying um so we'll have to see what continues with the game. I wasn't going to do any more videos in June, uh, but I'm going to just do these and the Call of Duty videos. Uh, that way I'm still mostly free, but you guys still have something to watch. Um, one thing that I thought about doing before was posting on weekends, because weekends are when, like, well, I guess it wouldn't make that much sense now. What are we even doing here? Uh... Um, oh, okay, we got the boat, so we're going to go try to break him out. Uh, I'm going to stand over here while I finish what I was saying, if I can remember what I was saying, uh, which I can't. What the fuck was I saying ten seconds ago until I pulled up to here? Oh, um, I wasn't planning on doing any videos. Uh, okay, what? I stopped at the point where I was not stupid. Um... I thought about doing videos on weekends and getting rid of, I don't know, like Monday and Tuesday or something like that. Um, because normally, um, when school is in, people have off on weekends. And on weekends, when you're home, I always have weekends off, for the most part. Um, so... I know that YouTube is quite shitty on the weekends, and I figured 
if I posted videos on the weekends, then you guys would have something to watch on the shitty days. Um, so maybe what I'm gonna do is do these videos on Saturday and the Call of Duty on Sunday just throughout June. It'll be quicker and easier with just the two of us. Plus, John will be calmer. We're oh, yeah, Sadie you. was the one that I was Ain't going no to pain. meet well, at the bar when I fell off the horse because of tuberculosis. Yeah, we know you are. We'll bring him back to you. Which I hope isn't a continuing Thank thing. Thank you both. Mrs. Adler. We'll land the boat in the morning. Prisoners come back out to work the field. Place is surrounded by marshland. Should hopefully give us a bit of cover to move in close enough to find our spot. Look for We're going up the channel. And all we gotta do is take out all the guards and row our way out of there. Seems simple enough. Yeah. How many times, Marshal? Ooh, the prison. This is when uh, Breakout from Thin Lizzy needs to start. That's a good song. That was actually in GTA 4. Let's head for that watchtower. Okay. Oh, we don't. <laughs> there's no silencers back then, so what am I doing? Sadie's one crazy some bitch. Um. Yeah, I only have these two guns. Coming over here, Sadie, you crackhead. I don't like that the music stopped. Usually it's the opposite. Once the music starts, that's when things get bad. On this game, the music stops and then it starts being a long, stringy, annoying thing. Take out the guard. Where are we going, Denny's? I like how, if I think about going out on a date, my very, very first thought is Denny's. <laughs> that says a lot about me, especially considering I've never been to a Denny's. <laughs> oh, wait, he has the rolling block. All right. Uh, John? Probably not. Where is he? Go He's not out battle. today. You can use the scope. Um, first of all, bitch. If I'm gonna be doing that, I'm getting rid of my fucking repeater. Look for John. Hey, I think I see him. There's a group in front of that ping. Just to our right. Ah, uh, yeah. I see two guards. Okay, take them out. And let's go get our boy. Okay. Notice they get down. Wait, there goes the siren. I don't think that was John. Well, let's go over there and see. Okay. Come oh, on. good job, Sadie. It's not even fucking John. You fucking dumb bitch. This is why I don't take friends out with me. <laughs> Dumb bitch. This is bad. Especially when, uh, when I have iridocyclitis now. I don't even know what the fuck on, that is. Arthur. Let's keep moving. Where is he? You see him? No. Oh. You, Mister. You know John Marsden? I. He ain't. He ain't working today. Put the gun down, lady. No. Perhaps. You put the gun down. Now. That volcanic pistol is one mean some bitch. Where's John Marston? She ain't in the work detail today. Okay, well, I guess we'll go and get him together. Try anything. 
anything, I'll blow your damn head off. You clear on that? Yes. Very clear. Oh, no, you don't. Kill him. Kill him, Come Sadie. On, Kill him. Now, why don't you apologize to the lady for pointing a gun at her? Excuse me? I said apologize. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Wow. They give up pretty quick. So, where do we go? Towards the entrance, I guess. And who's in charge of this fine establishment? Jameson, sir. Jameson who? No, Mr. Jameson. Heston Jameson. Uh, <laughs> fucking uh, pistol whipped him right in the back of the... Oh my god! <laughs> I look forward to meeting him. <laughs> they're, they're not gonna let you do She's this. one crazy well, son of a bitch. You, That's like, uh... Actually, she'd be a daughter of a bitch, but other way, otherwise, um, I can't remember the name of this woman, and there's a woman in the video game uh, Command and Conquer Red Alert. I can't remember her name, but she, you could send her into a, fuck, a group of fucking ten people, and she'd kill every single one of them. You could have her go into one town and just blow up a building and be like, yeah, bye. They have cannons? Dude, they could easily shoot her. Okay, fam, be cool now. Just do as I say. Put the weapons down. Don't do as I do. Do 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 do. Wow, that's a long ass walk when you're Going with someone that slow. He's insulting me. They got Milliken. Got him and gonna kill him. Unless you bring me John Marston. Right now. You got one minute. I'm counting. One. Two. He's looking rough. Three. Uh, uh, Milliken, <laughs> is it? Yes, sir. Will you count for me? I got talking to do. Uh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. <clears throat> From one or four? Oh, so? very funny. No, we must be at eleven by now. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Faster. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Sixteen. Now, hurry up. Well, this poor fool's gonna get his brain shot out. And over what? For nothing. Uh, Milliken, don't stop counting. I can't hear you. Now, hurry up and bring that asshole out here, you bastards. Come on. Don't cry, buddy. I don't want to die. Yeah, I know, I know. Hey, hey, John. Oh, you too? Now, no funny business. Well, Mr. Medican here will stop crying once and for all. Okay, today's your lucky day. Let's go. Time to get going. What lies ahead, I have no way of knowing. We got people to shoot, people to scoot. People to switch guns and shoot with another gun. Cause the other one sucks ass. God damn it, let me reload. Fuck it, Doc. Um. Fucking whore. Time to go, Arthur. Get your happy ass running, buddy. Holy fucking fuck. I can't. Arthur's all fucking woozy. I need to eat now. Fucking shoot at the guy in front of you. Are you retarded? Obviously. Uh -huh. Let me fully reload. Ain't 
trying to go yet. Can't even shoot that far. Okay, go. Look out on the left. Coming through the bar. My God, I'm shooting like garbage today. Need a faster shooting gun. That one has nothing but a scope. Gotta get volcanic, boy. It's the only close distance gun I have. Cool! I got absolutely obliterated by one fucking guy. Okay, I believe we got past that part with that garbage. Holy fuck, are you gonna die? I don't know why it does that. Right in the head. that much, but when I do, I do. I, I guess that's kind of how nearly everything works. I'm coming. I'm running. Why aren't I shooting? Uh, because we have people after us okay we yeah we definitely get into the boats top priority top priority get into the boat get into the boat get into the boat seem to need rescue Martin let's see god there's some fellas coming here don't look nothing like having tuberculosis and then on top of that uh i know i probably will cut it out in the uh the video, but I when I died I was using my volcanic pistol so when I respawned I didn't have it anymore so my best semi-automatic weapon look the only one I have is this now the double action revolver poor shit I think I have to really I missed him Couldn't go really fast with that, because he has to be a fucking pussy, because, you know, for some reason he can't fucking aim like a normal human being when he gets fucking shot once. It's a video game, it shouldn't be that realistic. You get hit once and you're like, oh, I'm good. Oh, well, we survived with minor bloodshot wounds like just kidding bloodshot wounds yeah i was shot with blood minor gunshot wounds wasting time that's us told them hey arthur thank you don't mention it let's go yeah let's fucking go gets wind of this Let's go before my tuberculosis gets to be a problem. Okay. Really? I completely you know, lost my volcanic pistol. Maybe it's because I didn't buy it. Jackie's Maybe if you die with a gun that she you didn't buy, then you don't get to keep it. Hosea. I think I got it's that one when we were on the somehow. island. All them years. Arthur. He was like... Like family. Yeah, we lost young Lenny too. No. What a goddamn mess. And then we. What about the the money? Lost we didn't get any. The bottom of the ocean. What? How the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat. The only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm and. We ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. Cuba? Wait, you're gonna have to tell me all this again. It's a long story, but... 
Things ain't been good, John. I got tuberculosis. And no one knows. Seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead too. Jesus. Maybe you should have just left me to hang. And uh, I should warn you, the Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so it might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. I can't stop thinking about this. In the bank, I thought we were gonna go the when other they way. Grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a, a moment to do something and didn't. The Dutch ain't himself huh. right now. Or maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Guess we don't need to worry about who's his I don't know. I haven't trusted uh, Dutch in a while. Yes, not. He seems like one of those people that acts nice in front of everyone, but secretly is a big asshole. Well, not really secretly anymore. He's becoming more of an asshole, like, up front all the time. Camp's still here. It's not as nice as it used to be. You brought him back to me! We told you we would. John! What are you doing here? Good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I went. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. Is that so? Yeah. I go when I want, where yes. I want, because I have tuberculosis and, and I'm dying. John brings the law down on all of us. What then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. Loyalty, Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! John. John. You are my brother. You are my son. I was coming for you. They... They was talking to hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. And now they may come and hang us all. I don't think they would. They'll shoot us. Now my tuberculosis is acting up worse. Hey, maybe... I don't know when... Let me let me look at this. Let, let me do a bit of go googling. Arthur, Arthur. Oh, sorry. I was miles away, thinking of. Uh, Dutch said to tell you he and Mike have gone to Annisburg. Something about Mr. Cornwall. 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 Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. I hate when this shit happens. I wanted to try to Google when the cure for tuberculosis was discovered, but, you know, my stupid phone. I guess the cure... For tuberculosis was uh it said first tested on a human in 1949 um i don't remember the time frame of this so yeah um what's micah up to now micah was just up here okay so we have to walk not walk ride our horse over to there um to speak with micah because he decided to be uh, a lot more convenient to talk in the next state than it would be here. Okay, let me get on my horse. Um, I will see you guys when we get over near Micah. Okay, we are pretty much to Micah now. Have to go somewhere over here. Oh. 
Was you followed? No. Was you followed? I said no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is your problem? What is your problem, partner? You don't, uh, you don't look so good. What is wrong with you? Nothing wrong with me. I'm fit as a fiddle. And I inside you ain't. I'm just a realist, friend. Micah reckons there's a rat. Oh, does he? On what evidence? He's only back a minute. Pinkerton show up. <laughs> We've been on the run since you two fools went crazy in Blackwater. We barely escaped with our lives in San Denis. Now we got a rat. Well, Molly clearly talked, but who else? Maybe we pushed things too hard. Uh, Maybe time for folks like us has passed. <laughs> we don't need a rat. We got sloppier than the town drunk. And they know who we are, and where we are, and what we're doing. The way I see it, the best thing we can do is let the week go. Move on, get our money, and start over. That ain't happening. Well, something's gotta happen, and fast. Otherwise, Cornwall, them Pinkertons, they've got us panned in here. And ain't none of them stopping. Well, Cornwall's why we're here. Shall we, Dutch? Yeah, it's time to go. Let's head to the river. Oh, leave Cornwall alone. Are we killing Cornwall? <laughs> we need money. But revenge? Now? Of course it's for money. Come on, Arthur. This better not be no stupid revenge mission, Dutch. It ain't worth it. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, Arthur. It's just a simple social call. <laughs> <laughs> I bet. I bet it is. So... What are we going to say to him that needs to be said? He has been hunting us since Valentine. He is the reason that Hosea got killed. His sugar business is destroying the people of Guarma. This town, Arthur, is his town. He bought it just to destroy these folks. His sugar, his oil, his law. These are wrongs that you can't write. Dutch. Yeah, his oil. Look at that right there. So why did oil in the water. Him? Unless that's supposed to be oil. I didn't want him hanged. Neither did I. We're gonna cut a deal, Arthur. What are you talking about? We want out. And Cornwall wants us to stop robbing him. And we all know his money is what's keeping the Pinkertons on our tail. He's America, Arthur. And I want out. And he... He won't let us go. This ain't making a lot of sense, Dutch. It will, son. It will. A deal, some noise, and then we're gone. Like every other thing, I don't expect this to end well. At all. Because it never does end well. Let's get down here. Okay. Arthur, you're going to blow our cover. Am I? Will you get out of sight? Wonder what they're bringing in. Sugar? Thank you for your Oil? hospitality, Mr. Cornwall. This was a business meeting, Mr. Milton. We are not friends. I have spent a considerable fortune with your agency, and still nothing. This Vanderlyn robs me and laughs at me. I asked for the best. I paid for the best. We are very close, Mr. Cornwall. I know you've heard this before. We can Sir, kill them all right now. I'm to Goldberg in New York. Tell him I won't borrow it more than 3.2%. Sorry, no, I have heard it before. And get that army man to pay his portage charge. Yes, sir. We are doing all we can within the confines of the law. The law? I think we both know what you can do with your law. Find me Dutch Vanderlyn. Bring him here and leave the laws to them as need them. Good day, sir. Come along, Mr. Ross. We have work to do. Mr. Didsbury. Mr. Cornwall. Now listen up, Didsbury. What's all this about strikes? I bought into this mine because of mismanagement. And I intend to make it a success no matter what the cost. It's the wages. Folk feel Folk that you... feel? Business doesn't give 
two figs about feelings, sir, not two figs. It's a nonsense that will bring a plague on both our houses, sir. Perhaps there's Shoot him in the a head. plague on your house already, do it. Mr. Cornwall. What do you want, sir? I'm not quite sure just yet. Your impudence will be your undoing, sir. I'm undone already. Even my best friend here, he thinks I'm crazy. And like this poor fellow you are talking to, my feelings are hurt. You robbed me, sir. And you robbed him. Funny world. You show a criminal's grasp of sophistry, sir. I did no such thing. You kill. I kill. You rob. I rob. Only difference I can see is I choose whom I kill and rob and you destroy everything in your path. I've heard just about enough. I'll tell you what. You give me this ship, $10,000, and safe passage out of here, I'll let you live. <laughs> I'll do no such thing. <laughs> you sure? Good. I prefer it this way. Got him. Good. Good. No matter what, he's dead. Ain't no change in that. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Oh, shit. What the hell have you done, Dutch? Can't be that many of them. You know, that's how that's how it works. I think this is going to be really close to the end. I have no idea how the game ends, though, so I really have not a clue. Oh, right in the hip. Before Mike even killed him. I'm shooting like a fucking monster now. Stay with me, Arthur. I'm coming. As long as my tuberculosis don't start acting up. There can't be that many of Cornwall's men. Er, okay, never mind. I was thinking Pinkerton. Does he know that I have tuberculosis? I didn't think he did. Now it is. Who is they shooting at? We're going in there? No? Okay. That's pretty dope. Let's go, let's go. Okay, I need to keep running. That's all I have to say about that. Yeah, let's go well, fucking now. At least we tried talking it out. Boys, lost your minds. Oh, I felt a lot of guilt in this life, Arthur. I've killed too often and poorly, but not this time, son. Come on. These are the big horses. All right, let's head for the hills, boys. They're trying to block us all. Go right. We got a pine box for you. Didn't even get a chance to even closely hit him.
Oh, we're definitely heading for the hills. I'm worried about uh, hitting stuff. Okay. We're good, we're good. I think what was probably gonna happen is we're gonna go back to our camp. Fuck. Yeah, lose them through the river. Sure, that's worked many times before. God damn. Um, I think what's going to happen, we're going to get back to camp. Then we're going to take our whole camp onto the boat that we pretty much took over by killing everyone there. So Cornwall's finally dead. And I think we'll have our chance to make our getaway. Interesting social call. No, oh, don't play dumb and superior at the same time, Morgan. We all knew sooner or later Cornwall had to go. Let me see them papers. It's more attention we don't need. Feels like the whole world's closing in on us. Dutch, it won't be long before they find where we're hiding out now. Especially as we ain't exactly hiding out. We just need a distraction. Buy us some time. Looks like Mr. Cornwall's company. They signed a railroad contract with the army. And they're also moving dynamite down from, well, the Annisburg mines to San Denis to resell. And there's bonds at his oil factory. Maybe there's a way to get them off our back and get the money that we need. Mike, you look into this dynamite. Take Bill, I guess, Arthur. You go too. We are going to need a lot of it. And Mike, we need to talk. Figure out some things. Of course, boss. Figure out what? The plan. Getting out of here. Nothing's changed. It hasn't, huh? There's an old house west of Van Horn. Meet me there when you can, Black Lung. Let's split up. We'll meet up back at camp. Yeah. Black Lung. This is crazy. Okay, so now I have to meet him. Wait. That's Reverend Swanson. He needs to speak to me about what? Um. Okay, I'll do that one, then I'll go see about the Micah one. Because the Swanson one's closer. I like normally doing, like, Micah's because that's the next in the story. Like, it goes directly with the next part, but I try to do, like, closest ones so I don't have to, uh, sit around for a while. Or, like, ride a longer distance than I really need to. Okay, we're already here. That was quick. Reverend Swanson. <coughs> Reverend, you okay, Mr. Morgan? I don't know, Reverend. These are challenging times for all of us. Yes, very challenging. You don't seem yourself somehow. I, I've always felt... I've left the morphine, sir. Arthur, I'm Reverend Swanson, would you excuse us a minute? Of course. New York. We are going to go to New York. Now, they have been chasing us south and east and west. We're going to get a boat. We're going to get on a river, and we're going to go north. New York. Then Tahiti, the Fiji Islands, or this place, New Guinea, dancing girls, freedom. But first, we have to make a whole lot of smoke, a whole lot of commotion and then we disappear we need more commotion one score and one whole hell of a lot of noise we ain't so good at doing scores anymore dutch are you feeling all right arthur 
Sure, fine. Pardon me for interrupting. Oh, I forgot about them. I brought a friend, Arthur. Hello. Hello. Dutch. This is Eagle Flash. His father is a great chief. Charles and I, we uh, pretended to be mercenaries. He did me a great favor. Dutch Vanderlyn. How do you do? Not well, sir. Well, I am sorry to hear that. How's your father? Father is confused. Wisdom with weakness. His people, my people. We've suffered too much. Been lied to too much. Now they've taken our horses. Who? The infantry division posted at Fort Wallace. Why? Colonel Favors is a liar and a murderer. His people won't stop until we're all dead. Without horses, we cannot hunt. Without hunting, we will starve. This is another act of war. I see that. Men have helped me before. I have Fort money. Wallace is like up near Valentine, I believe. Son. What do you think, Charles? You know, I told your father I will not fight over some horses. But I made no such promise. Come along. Yeah. Arthur, we must go with them. And try to stop things from getting out of hand. I guess. Come along. Arthur's looking bad. Get them more horses. I know. I understand Eagle Flash is angry, but I don't see how this will help anything. Especially not with Dutch whipping them up into a frenzy. We've got enough folks coming after us without adding armies to the list. Don't let these bastards walk all over you? No, you're not. This is all that's wrong with this world. Okay, young man, lead the way. The horses are on a boat near Van Horn. I have a man waiting for us there with some canoe. Now, Van Horn. Oh, okay. I was thinking Fort Wallace. Not Van Horn. Okay, that's that's much different. Surely this can be done without killing anyone. Of course. What will be will be. Anyway, son, tell me about this Colonel Favors. He's a vile man. He and his regiment take pleasure of persecuting us. All the young have been taken from our reservation. Shipped off to reform schools. Many women, too. The old are weak and sick, but they deliberately withhold medicine and supplies from us. This ends today. You have my word on that. There's a fox. Why are you getting involved in this, Dutch? You know me. We shoot fellers as need shooting. We save fellers as need saving. Feed them as need feeding. Not this again. It's been quite a while since we helped anyone but ourselves. And even you know that. I told you. Noise. We need noise, Arthur. Noise and faith. I still don't know what that means. Stop questioning and think. Just think. Second, the Pinkertons have had time to reinforce. The civilized world is closing on us. Who knows what else Molly told them? We need to move towards a conclusion now. Sure, but what's this got to do with any of that? Some good, honest conflict between the army and the Indians might be just the distraction we need. Kill two birds with one stone. Cornwall was funding the Pinkertons' assault on us. Why do you think I dealt with them? With Cornwall gone, the government is far more likely to divert them to other issues, especially if there's one more scandal. And then we can slip away. Like I said, we just need that noise and one more score. You know, I went back for the chest I had hidden outside Shady Bell, and we're close, Arthur. That dynamite, the railroad contract with the army, it was all in those papers Micah found. I have a plan. You just have to trust me. Every time we trust him, he fucks something up. Okay. What are we doing here? There's someone over there. There's Peta. 
His men, like I said, they'll help us. I got the canoes. The boat is still moored in the channel. Good. Let's wait until nightfall. Okay. We're waiting till right. nightfall. We can set out. As always, I have to control the whole thing. We need to get that boat ashore. I think the best plan is to paddle up there silently, order. And when we yeah, boy. control, we'll deal with that anchor, float away. <laughs> we'll be ashore before anybody even knows what happened. Good luck. Try not to kill anyone, Arthur. Try not to kill anyone? What's that? What fun's that? He doesn't want me to kill. I don't know what to tell you, buddy. Can I... Okay. <laughs> No fucking fun. You mind the horses? I need to smoke. Oh, oh shit. I fucked up. I fucked up bad. Of course, I can't fucking hit him. There's a tiny little railing. Okay. That wasn't nearly as stealthy as I like it to be. Great idea to blow up a an anchor. That uh went pretty quick. Sure. Come here. Come on. Yeah. Come here. You can't really go that quick when you're in deep water. Get 
get his horses back to him. What the heck was that? Oh, we, I guess, walked over a fish and killed it or something. Turn the horses to my men. Well, Arthur, oh, Arthur needs to rest. I will. I like you, son. And after the horses, are we going to wait for the army to come and wreak its revenge? I hope not. Of course we ain't. Now let's go check out that fort of theirs. Is this a good idea? This is the only idea, and it is one that will suit both of our purposes. Um, the army ain't it is Fort Wallace Southport. that we're going to, huh? Oh, and Sadie told me about Combe. Meet us at Doyle's Tavern in San Denis when you can. Shall we go, son? Certainly. We'll start some light reconnaissance out of Fort Wallace, and when Combs dealt with, you come meet us there. We'll set up a good spot for you. I don't know, Dutch. Yeah, well, I do. This is exactly the distraction that we need. Your father said that fighting was an impossible gamble. There's no winning for you in this. Your father need not know anything. He'd rather live in ignorance. Come along, gentlemen. Your father would rather you did not do anything so foolish. I said I would stop this from happening. Would you talk to him? Quick with rageful. Yes. Would you? I'll sure. try. I'll speak with him. You head on back to camp, check on the others, Dutch's behavior. I understand. Thank you, Arthur. Okay. I feel like that choice will probably get me on Dutch's bad side. Um, I think I'm going to end the video there. Uh, next episode, I think we're going to start with uh, meeting Micah. For several reasons, because that's the closest one. Um, what is that one? Weapons Forbidden. Okay, so we're going to go up there above Valentine and then attack Fort Wallace with that mission. Uh, but then we also have where we have to meet um, Sadie at the bar. And also, what? Goodbye, dear friend. I'm curious of what that one's about. Uh, and Dutch is going to be there, too. That's where Dutch told us to meet him. Um, but we're going to definitely do this one first. Van Horde training post. Okay. Yeah, we're going to start with the Micah 1 next episode. Uh, but that's going to be it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next one. And if you did enjoy the video, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to click one of my previous, next, and related videos. And don't forget to check out my other social medias in the description down below.